Have you ever felt like your phone takes an eternity to charge wirelessly? You're not imagining it. Most standard wireless chargers deliver power at a slower rate, typically around 5 to 15 watts, compared to modern wired fast chargers that can push 25, 45, or even over 100 watts. While slow and steady might sound safer, it's not necessarily better for your battery's health in the long run. The longer your phone stays on the charger, the more time it spends under the stress of a charging state, often accompanied by that damaging heat. Ironically, many modern wired fast charging systems are designed to be gentler on the battery, using smart technology to manage power, delivery, and minimize heat, ultimately completing charging cycles more efficiently and with less strain. The convenience of simply dropping your phone on a pad can lead to habits that put extra stress on your battery. Wireless charging makes it incredibly easy to top up your phone frequently throughout the day. While keeping your battery between 20% and 80% is generally good advice. Constant microchargers still contribute to the battery's cycle count. Every battery is manufactured with a limited number of charge cycles it can endure before it starts to degrade significantly. A charge cycle is typically defined as a full discharge from 100% to 0%, but partial charges add up cumulatively. By constantly topping up wirelessly, you might be accelerating the consumption of these limited cycles, wearing out your battery faster than if you were to charge it less frequently with a wired connection. Perfect placement is crucial for effective wireless charging, but it's often overlooked. Your phone's receiver coil and the charger S transmitter coil must be perfectly aligned for the most efficient power transfer. If your phone is even slightly off center, the connection becomes weaker. This misalignment forces the system to work harder, which not only slows down the charging speed dramatically, but also generates even more excess heat. You might wake up in the morning to find your phone barely charged and uncomfortably hot, all because it was knocked a few millimeters off the sweet spot during the night. This constant battle for alignment can contribute significantly to both battery degradation and user frustration. Your protective phone case, which is designed to prevent scratches and drop damage, could also be interfering with your charging. Thick, rugged cases, especially those with metal components or kickstands, can create a barrier that obstructs the electromagnetic field. This forces you into the tedious routine of removing the case every time you want to charge your phone. Constantly taking your phone in and out of a tight-fitting case increases the chances of scuffs and scratches on the phone, S-frame, and back panel. It is a frustrating trade-off where the convenience of wireless charging is negated by the inconvenience and potential wear and tear caused by your phone case. So, how can you use wireless charging without slowly killing your phone? First, invest in a high-quality charger from a reputable brand. As cheap, uncertified pads are often inefficient and lack 